Well, there may be a new self-serve motorized wheelchair service coming to Tampa International Airport. Right now, it is still being tested, but airport says that early feedback from people who have been giving it a whirl has been overwhelmingly positive. 10 Tampa Bay's Eric Glasser has a closer look. I think it's great. Thomas Hicks recently busted his leg, but wasn't about to have an airline worker push him and his crutches through the airport. So instead, he's giving Will a whirl. I'd rather be independent. I'd rather take care of stuff myself than have somebody pushing me around. The motorized wheelchairs are free for passengers, those with mobility issues, injuries, or anyone, really, who would prefer to roll on their own. Users just share their name and flight info. Yeah. All right, let me show you how to use one of these, all right? And then off they go, using the motorized wheelchairs as long as they need to until they get on their flight. An attendant will stop by the gate to pick it up later. Stop along the way, grab some food, go to a restaurant, use the restroom, and really have that flexibility and that control and independence. They bring it right back here to the station and we charge it up for the next person. Charge it and sanitize it and clean it, make sure it's all wiped down and sanitized and charge it up for the next person. By law, airlines are obligated to provide wheelchair service and with that, a small army of so-called pushers. A contract with wheel could help reduce those labor costs if more people like Curtis Bostrom decide. I'm independent, like to do it myself. The wheel pilot program here at Tampa International ends this Friday. After that, the airport says it'll be up to the company and the airlines to decide whether to make it a more permanent arrangement. This is absolutely a service that people have loved so far, everybody who's used it. So we really, really hope that it can come back and stay.